Sudan Phase 1 RPJJ 2200591 Today I will present my assignment that was given by Dr. Siti Soraya Lin about my job I was work at the, the, the Department of Social Welfare as an assistant of community welfare under the Ministry of Women, uh, Family and Community Development that has implemented financial assistance scheme to help the poor family, older persons and persons with disabilities there are have three personal inside my job. The first one, income maintenance for the poor and needy family to fulfill uh, their basic needs. Uh, the secondly is to encourage the productive target groups to work and live independently. Uh, and the last one is uh, to improve the quality of life of target group for a better living. My daily routine that was I do during my job are uh, make the report, receive requests from clients and conduct investigation. Review existing case, manage of payment watcher, contact clerk, investigate the natural disaster case uh, such as a uh, flash road, storm, uh, red fire, and landslide. As an assistant of community welfare, my responsibilities include supporting community outreach program, coordinating events, and cooperating with local organizations to address social needs. I assist in implementing uh, incentives that enhance uh, the well-being of individuals and family, fostering a sense of uh, community and facilitating access to essential resources. The targeted group that was my department provide to take responsibilities are children, older person, disabled person, violence means kegenasan rumah tangga, destitute, disaster victim, community service order means uh, pesalah muda, and the poor people. My best experience for 15 years service at the Malaysian Department of Social Welfare as Assistant Community Welfare is I can learn how to help the community to solve the problems which is uh, counselling, financial facilities and more. Secondly, um, sometimes this work uh, gives me feel tension and stress to handle some client. But from there, I can learn and improve my anger management. Overall, I enjoy with my job. Thank you. Hello, good day to my friends and lecturers. I would like to talk about my work as per JEE 100 second part of assignment. My work is as per a customer service representative working in Siva Logistics Sendirian Berhad. In Siva Logistics Sendirian Berhad, we store the goods from worldwide, for example, from Japan, China, US, Australia, store them in our warehouse and send them to the end customer, which are Intel, Jabil, Micron, and etc. All the MNCs companies in the industry. We store all of the products in our system and also the warehouse. After storing them in our warehouse, we scan them using the scanning system and all the scanning items will be recorded in our system. The system will also be shown to our end customers so they would be able to order directly from their end. Next, I would like to talk about our system that we are using in our logistics company. We are using WMS system which is directly connected to our end customer. They would able to they would be able to know what items are received at our end after we scan the items in our system. So direct uh, needs will be known from them after they place the orders we have within three days to deliver them with exact uh, amount of of the items and also the example if we have to deliver the cool room temperature uh, items we have to order one day ahead dry ice so these kind of special needs have to be prepared earlier so that our customers will be known that this is cool room temperature and will not waste the items we all will be very happy if our work has been appreciated by our managers and also HQs. So, rather than waiting for any appreciation from the upstairs management, we would we should actually give ourselves a tap on our shoulders as we have done our good job. Thank you. Hello, good morning everyone. 
My name is Joseph, and it's a raining Saturday today. But I still got to do my assignment for my subject called JU each 100. So let me briefly show you guys what is my usual Saturday about. Come on, let's go. journey to work will cost around 1 hour to 1 hour 15 minutes so as I'm walking to the place where I am working here we are that's right I'm actually a music teacher for the past two decades and I am teaching in one of the school as a relief teacher every Saturday and here we are my first student of the day his name is Harris say hi to everyone Harris so what is the challenge that we usually face injury we have to protect our hand. I had a fall due to heavy rain and get sleepy. Here, what is become? A week of medical leave. So that is a very common issue that we have to take care. I guess that's all for today. Thank you everyone for watching this. Hi, good day to everyone. Okay, my name is Shankari Chandrasegaran. The purpose of this video, I'm doing this video is for my English subject. The code is JUE100. Okay, this is our second task given by our lecturer to test our speaking skills and the fluency of our speaking. And hence, I'm going to talk about my topic, which is, uh, is my job. This topic would be more to the job that I'm doing now. Well, for the more, for the my narration, Currently, I'm working in a water industry named Parvadana Bhakran Ayapulapina, which is called PBAPP. It is known as a GLC company. I'm working in the GLC company. Okay. Um, my, my, actually, my department in the company is uh, internal audit. I'm working in the internal audit department okay. uh, as an internal audit assistant. Okay. Uh, further, further, don't delay about the, my introduction. So, I would like to go to into this my job okay my job is like more to the data analysis and uh, data comparisons and more for the data collections okay okay actually i put this slides it's for more understanding but i think i would don't have the um, i don't have much time to explain about my job my job is the scope of my job is a lot more and this is my task is my scope is a task of internal audit assistant why and why internal audit is more important in the organizations okay further though okay this okay this is what i tell about the my job is collecting data compilation and analysis investigate the audit issues and then audit findings okay and at last last why the internal audit is more important in the organization it is like uh, essential to maintain the operational efficiency and financial reliability and to safeguard the assets so this is why the internal audit is more important in the glc so um for the internal audit according to the bursa malaysia bank negara malaysia so internal um, all the glc companies um they have to have this department in their company so this is a um a, procedure in the bank negara to have the internal audit so this is my job thank you everyone hello everyone my name is tanishwari and i'm from Plank. i have been working for four years now ever since i have completed my studies 
my diploma education major in electric electronic engineering from sultan abdul halim mudsam shop polytechnic and how time flies now i'm currently working as an engineering data technician at micron technology plant i have all, always searched for new experience to challenge myself which helps with my career growth knowledge and strength okay let me explain about what is let me explain about my daily routines as an engineering data technician i as i as engineers in developing process to resolve process variance equipment or device performance problems and provide for product quality control and efficiency first of all disposal spc fails and other product using tools provided isolate product that has been shipped and content affected product as needed thirdly identify problems with calls and communicate to the call owner and complete with the ap research research deviations to determine cause and ensure containment follow the proper escalation procedure to communicate and resolve the problem with the time period